Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Midnight Woods is my name, and tonight Midnight Woods will be playing Act 3 of Tokyo Jungle Story Mode. So, the title is Mother and 1000 Miles. You're a lost fawn desperately seeking your mother. Her protection is needed for you to survive in this predator infested city. Follow your mother's faint scent to feel her love again. Okay, let's see what happens in Act 3. Act 3, Mother and 1000 Miles. The lost deer fawns have followed their mother's scent here. With dangerous predators on the prowl, they won't survive long without protection. Rendezvous with your mother. Okay, well, where is she? Alright, well, I guess I can see it on the map. Oh, right, she's, um, okay. Well, I guess I'll have to eat or drink something on the way there. Oh, here we go. Here's a puddle. I was just about to drink that. Oh, come on, don't cutscene me past that puddle. I was just about to drink that. Now, come on, game. You don't need to do that. Right, well, what's going on? Well, what was that all about? What was that all about? I can see the food from here. Yeah, I know that I can double jump. Okay, well, fair enough, because uh, I suppose a lot of the people playing through the story mode, Act 3, a lot of them might have been might be playing this game for the first time, but to be fair, I have played through story mode two or three times before, and I've played several runs in survival mode, so obviously I know that as uh, a small grazer, I am able to double jump now. It looks like... Well, okay. There's a hyena prowling about. Proceed with caution. You'll be in grave danger if it spots you. Oh, I've got to use one of those blue boxes. I never use those in survival mode. I've never actually felt the need to... You can hide from the predator by getting in there. By there, they mean the box. Uh, but don't get spotted while on the move. Okay, so... Uh, this one is... We've got to be a bit stealthy here. So, can I go through here? Can't see a thing. Right, it's watching, so we can't move. Now we can move. Stop, it's turning around. Don't come too close. Thank you. Ah, uh, that's the way past. Okay, well, I want this uh, bush of fruits. Right, I still need to hide in this... Well, it looks like a bin. Uh, I don't actually know what it is. Alright. Sneak past. Oh, I need to... Uh... Right, it's watching. So careful. Don't get spotted. Now come on, in the real world, a hyena looking for food would think the box was in one place a few seconds ago and now the box has moved. I think that in the real life, uh, unless the animal is really, really stupid or blind, I think that is a little bit suspicious. Okay, let's eat this flower. I'll continue wandering around with this box on. I don't... No, I don't really need to eat that. We might as well, because I don't know if I'm going to need it or not. It doesn't look like I will, actually. There we go. Okay, well, I've still got the box. Oh, but no, not anymore. Is it a box? Is it a bin? I don't know what it is. And how is that? It's amazing that just a deer is able to move something like that about. 
I, I do need to use it more. It, oh, uh, your mother isn't here. It seems she's already moved on somewhere else. Uh oh. That's not good. You'll both be today's main course if you don't do something. Activate your defense ability. Well, I would just outrun it or go somewhere that the cheetah can't follow me, but still. Let's see what it wants me to do. Oh, yeah, well, actually, that's one way as well. Okay, so I'm now on my own. I've got to outrun it. Well, that wasn't too difficult to just outrun it. Okay, what, what next? It looks like you can use the scaffolding to reach the roof. Start tracking her scent again. What? Well, how am I supposed to track her scent through a television? Now, I do think that... I don't know, what, what animal am I actually? I don't actually know. But if I'm a gazelle or something, or one of the size 3 deers, I should be able to clean kill the hyenas, but I don't know if it works or not. Okay, well, there's none around. Aren't there? Oh, dear. Okay, well, luckily they didn't hear or see me. They were fast asleep. So... Oh, okay, yep, yeah, I see where it is. I don't really need that fruit. Luckily, there doesn't appear to be uh, any dangerous predators around. All right, well, let's creep inside this... Uh, this bin, which seems to be a lifesaver. Oh, this is a really awkward camera angle. Now, I guess I'd go... Oh, no! Oh, no! I think I've been seen. Oh, dear. That's not good. Okay, but well, it looks like I've failed this mission. Uh, so... Although... Oh dear, this is bad. And where is... Where do I go? Okay, well I can get there, no problem. Can I outrun them? Oh! Okay. Okay, well that didn't go as planned. Your mother isn't here. It seems she's already moved on somewhere else. The mother obviously isn't very... Care. She doesn't really seem to uh, care. Well, why, why don't... I mean, surely a sensible mother would go somewhere and then just stay there until I get there. Or maybe she got traced... Uh, she got chased away by dangerous predators as well. So, where do we need to go? Oh, we need to go into the station. I need to get some of this life back. Uh, what animal have we got ahead of us? It must be a dangerous predator. What is it? Right. Just going to wait here, get some life back. Now, I'm going to try something. I'm going to try clean killing it. And even if I don't manage, I should be able to stun it anyway. And then I just outrun it. That's what I do in survival mode all the time. And it works absolutely fine. So let's just see what happens. Life is going up really slowly. I'm just waiting for my life to go up. I am actually lucky to still be alive. All right, let's see what happens. Can I clean kill them? No, I can't. Right, run it. Run, 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 run. Oh, no, I'm still in danger. No, I'm not in danger. I'm fine. It's nowhere near me. I quite often do that in survival mode because usually they're not able to catch up. Okay. A dinosaur... Well, dinosaurs are easy to get away from. You just go in the, the tight places they can't fit. Well, that's no problem. Oh, there's two of them. I tend to just go up here. I know they can't go in here. So even if they see me, I don't actually know if it matters. Oh, well, they didn't anyway. 
Wow, there's a lot of animals over here. Oh, no, it, it it's, uh, doesn't appear to be dangerous predators. It appears to be my brothers and sisters. Have I made it? Your mother isn't here either. Why did I scare them all away? You approach a gazelle herd, but they don't look too friendly. The quest to find your mother continues. Oh, right. So, um, okay. Well, it, it looks like the story will be continuing in the next video then, because that is... Act 3 over with. Uh, it seems like I'm a very scary um, deer because I managed to scare a whole herd away. They, they all ran away. Um, okay, well, uh, that is Act 3 done. So I guess we'll find out what happens in Act 4. And uh, that will be in a future video. So uh, that's Act 3 done. Thank you for watching this video and I will see you again shortly.